welcome back. <clears throat> so another video. So don't worry, I'm not wearing the same clothes or anything like that. I'm just well, I am, but I've done this video just straight after the pills now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to crack open a beer. I'm not going to do a pour on it. It's judge me all you want if you want. Um, but I can't do a video without a beer. There's a reason that I'm having a beer for this. So let's get this poured out. So, right, so some of you might have seen just recently uh, there was a video that I see come about not that long ago from a YouTuber called Simo Subs. Now, his video basically said drink for dementia. So, obviously, I checked it out. I've seen Brivet Rick Shaw's done a video on it as well. So, for those of you that may have seen it or may not, so Simo Soaps, it does beer reviews on YouTube. Now, just recently did a video, um, I think it was about two, three weeks ago, uh, talking about his granddad uh, got dementia. Um, and I think he I think he started to get symptoms over Christmas. Um, and it's basically started to progress worse on, if you know what I mean. So basically, I think he was wanting to do a chug kind of challenge, drunk for dementia. Obviously, I'm not going to chug my beer, obviously, because it's a Guinness. Obviously, I don't want to chug it. So the reason I'm doing the video on it is because, obviously, dementia is quite a close personal thing to me as well. Because obviously, my nana uh, had it before she passed away. She had it for a few years. Um, and obviously, my wife wakes in a care home. Um, it's mostly dementia patients and it's it's a disease that's just no, nobody should ever like get dementia it's one of the worst diseases out there i've watched the video on brew bit rick shaw he didn't he explained it the best way um obviously i'm not gonna explain the way he said it because he's already done a video on it but if you haven't already seen it take a look um so obviously i'm gonna take a my first drink So, obviously, like I say, I'm not going to do a chug on that because it just won't go. Uh, I'll do it on a shorts video, though. Um, like I say, it is a short video. Um, obviously, for a lot of people that don't know, like I say, with dementia, it's a disease where... How can I... I've done, I've done the best way to explain it. But, obviously, for... I, you think a lot of elderly just get it, but obviously when I speak, to, I've spoken to my wife about it a few times. And like she said, there's people that can get it at such a young age. She read an article a while back about a four-year-old that got it. So you can get it at any age. Anybody can get it. Um, See, so obviously, I didn't know too much about it at the time. Obviously, when my nana got it, um, I would say. I just thought it. I just thought it was like a thing that people got as they got older. But obviously, it's where your mind, your memory can be stuck at a certain age. So obviously, you can remember certain things from when you was younger. And like obviously, like people say, you don't always remember the things that have happened most recently. So a lot of the time, you stick to a certain age from when you was younger. See, it's like my nana. Like when she had it, um, like. When my mum used to go see her, they, um, like one of the ways she used to sort of like she spoke about someone, the way my nana would remember me, because obviously in college I did electrical, uh, electrician's course. So she was saying Matt, the one who does electrics, and she knew who I was. But she'd remember that way. And it's it's like it's heartbreaking to see to see them go through it. Um, you know, it's 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 an horrible disease. It's not like I don't know, with people with dementia, like it can usually change like their attitude towards people. It's not like and like sometimes when they get it, there can be it can turn them like a lot of people think they're nasty with it, but it's not them being nasty themselves. It's the disease itself that's making them sort of like go through the different sort of feelings and that kind of thing. So if you ever know anybody that's got it, um, obviously if if it gets to that point where they 
they seem a bit nasty or anything like that it's not them doing it it's a disease it's dementia it's it can play differently on uh, like different people it's different like my nana she was never like she was the same person but like say she had that memory loss there but like say it's not the person that's changing it's the brain it's the way dementia does it I know there is things now, there's medication out there that you can get and I think you're supposed to slow it down a bit. Um and it's not the best it's not the best out there. It is it is horrible, especially when it's a loved one, someone so close to you. But you've just gotta be there for them. You've just gotta support them every, you know, all the way. And you know, just don't you know, don't forget about them. Um obviously my obviously my wife she works, like I say, she works in the care room and she knows a lot of elderly in there with dementia where the families don't even bother to come see them they wait and see them on christmas day and they just leave them once they've got dementia they think right they forgot about me they don't know where i am and they forget about them it's no it's not the way to do it always be there for them stick by them do you know what i mean like support them even if they don't remember you are even if they can't remember your name still go see them do you know what i mean they're still your family at the end of the day so yeah, I'm gonna let's say obviously I'm not gonna chug it but I'm gonna sup this one. Um so yeah, just it's raising awareness for dementia. Um let's say the more people know about it, the more awareness raised about it, you know, obviously you know like sometimes the science to look out for. Um but yeah, so obviously it's Simo. Um, this is me raising a glass to your granddad, um, and obviously you've got the support from all Brewtubers, everybody on the YouTube community, you know, your family, everyone's, everybody's in this together. Um, so yeah, like I say, if you ever need to chat to anyone, you know, <laughs> you know all the Brewtubers, beer reviewers, anybody, anybody will chat, do you know what I mean? So yeah, raising a glass, uh, like I say, raising a glass to awareness to dementia so yeah if you're not too sure about it i know there is a website you can go look at um let's say i'll pop a link in below uh go check it out and yeah let's say raising awareness to it this is my little take on it um let's say i've tried to explain it the best way i can um obviously if you're having a little bit of experience of witnessing it and having a family that have gone through it so so yeah cheers to everyone um so yeah, if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, um, and let's say, go check out Simo's video, obviously, if you want to read the full, like, hear the full story of it, of what he's spoke about, um, so yeah, cheers for watching, and uh, I'll see you on the next one, so stick around, cheers. Oh. I will do a chug on a shorts video for dementia. Cheers again. See you next time.